go. The one and both the fabulous, Ken Join us tonight. Uh, we come to you. We are going to need one of your brain souls to join us here on stage. We are going to take one of you. And no, you run away. <laughs> we need a volunteer for this next section of the show. It's very active. It's harmless. It's painless. We just want to come over and find out a little bit about you. Great. Yes, you, you raise your hand right here. What's your name? Renee. Renee. Great. We'll tell you to come on stage. It's gross. It's gross. It's just all fried. Yeah, it's like fried food, and there's like a base layer of macaroni, yeah, right? Yeah. And there's chili, yeah. and there's fried meats, yep. and like sauce. Yeah. Like, is there kind of sauce on it? Yeah, it's okay. all sorts of. It's gross. Yeah. Okay, great. Great. Uh, Renee, what do you do here in town? Nothing. Okay, great. <laughs> That's a lot here. Uh, when you're not busy doing nothing, what else do you do? Um, what do you like to do for fun? Sing. Okay, great. Let's, uh, let's dive into that. Singing. Do you sing in a choir? Do you sing in a band? Do you sing solo? I'm working on that. I've only been here for three months. Okay, only been here for three months. Great, so you're looking to perform. Yes. Right? What, what style of uh, music or what genre do you like to perform? Uh, uh, R&B and jazz. Woo! R&B and jazz. A lot of William Pop fans are jazz fans as well. Okay. Uh, great, um, and then what is uh, what is your range? What would they call where you sing? Is it soprano or alto? Pretty, pretty good. Pretty good, great, yes. <laughs> Those are words. Yeah, yeah. Good. Okay, great. Uh, what brought you to Wilmington from Rochester? Oh, well, I'm, I'm from Rochester, but, but I've lived in Albany for the last 30 years. Oh, uh, I'm so sorry. Yeah. My bad. Great. Uh, great. What brought you to Wilmington from Albany? If you can tell us. If you can't tell us, just give me a thumbs down. We'll move on. Um, my husband died. Oh, your husband died. Okay, great. I'm sorry. That's okay. That's great. A beautiful man. Um, what um, would you would you like to share a fun memory you had with your husband with us? You don't have to. Um. Uh, What's one of your favorite things about these? Oh, okay. <laughs> so, um. No, I'm not going to tell you that. Okay. That's, that's uh, he played a trick on me. We, he got sick. We were in Virginia. We were living there for a year. He. Uh, um, pretended like it was worse than what it was. I walk in, he's in a bath of ice because he's got high temperature. And I walk in the room and he says, Daddy, is that you? <laughs> <laughs> that was his. <laughs> that was his. So, we would say he had a good sense of humor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, great. Beautiful, uh, beautiful. Uh, so you've been down in Wilmington for three months. What's one of your favorite things you've discovered in Wilmington so far? Um, so far, um, uh, food. The food! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. 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 The food! Yeah. The food! We fucking love to eat. <laughs> so good. Uh, is there one place in particular that you found that you're like, oh, this is my joint, it's my jam? There's a, uh, donut? 
place downtown in Wilmington. Okay. And um, I went searching for it the other day and ended up not finding it, but found another one. Oh. And there was a guy walking around with an umbrella, and he, it was raining, and he was like, can I help you? And I said, why? Why are you walking around with an You asked him why he's walking around with an umbrella? Yeah, I said, are you just following me for fun? Okay. And he's like, no, we have, you know, we want people to be happy in Wellington, so we help people. This is a concierge thing. I said, do you get paid for it, or is it just something that you... Fun. He's like, oh no, I get, I get paid for it. I, get, I said, oh, no, oh okay, I okay. think you want to do it. Great. Did he help? Did he show you to the donut place? He did. He even waited for me to come out so that I didn't walk and ran back to my car. Wow. Welcome to Wilmington. <laughs> <laughs> One last question for you. Yeah. If you had a motto, the way you lived your life, yeah, yeah. what would that motto be? Something you could pass on to all of us here in the house tonight. Have fun. Have fun. Amen. Uh, let's give it a round of applause, please. Thank you, man. That's all we do. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, please enjoy our next talk. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Do you need help, sir? Do you need help opening that umbrella, sir? I'm here to help you, sir. Anything you need, let me know, sir. I'm here to help you. <laughs> Welcome to Wilmington. What? <laughs> Welcome to Wilmington, sir. First time here? You're standing on what's called Water Street. I know. They call that because it's the closest street to the water. <laughs> what's that? What? No. What? What's that? No, don't be afraid, sir. You need help opening that umbrella. <laughs> Welcome to Wilmington. <laughs> Can I answer you in a donut? Wilmington is known for its plethora of donut shops and establishments of fried dough. <laughs> That's one of our welcome droids. Are you No, I am 100% real human. Here's a map. I, I'm holding a map. <laughs> you need help picking that map off the ground, sir? I need a help. Me too. I, I, I got it. <laughs>
You okay? Do you need, do you need uh, help? Uh, I'm locking up. Okay, all right, no, I'm gonna get you out of there, okay? No, no, let me show. What are you doing? I gotta win the Olympics in 2020 something. <laughs> you are the greatest hope that Great Britain has ever had. <laughs> tell me, tell me I'm the best. You're the best? Oh, God, you are cold. Yeah. You are really cold. Okay, uh, okay. No, I gotta get you out of there, man. My heart's shutting down. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, all right, I'm gonna use a shovel like. <laughs> 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 All right, sirs. We here because your friend is dead. <laughs> Explain to me again how you thought the Olympics coming up in 2020 wouldn't coming um, <laughs> would be helped by a javelin thrower in ice. Well, so the the idea was we were going to make his muscles really tight and then really loose. And then it was kind of like, you know, that movie where the kid breaks his arm and then he's way fast with the baseball, and I thought... Rookie did. of the year! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, rookie of the year. It was basically your regular old rookie of the year scenario. What are you in for? I heard it was cryo-murder. <laughs> <sighs> I'm just an old-fashioned room temperature. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I iced it. What? <laughs> That's where you get your nickname around here. We're calling the Mice Man! The Mice Man! Oh, the Mice Man! The Mice Man! The Mice Man! The Mice Man! Yeah, I was Ice Man number two! Ice Man! 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 Ice Man! Don't you say this place so <laughs> I'll run a wonderful prison and very nice. <laughs>
God damn it. Radio's broken. God, now we have no music. I can sing. <laughs> well, I mean, what would you call yourself? A soprano? An alto? Or yeah, that's all good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I mean, can I can I just work you like a radio, Timothy? Or like if, if I more like a jukebox, put a, at least a quarter in. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. Okay. At least a quarter. Okay. I'd like to hear some Buddy Holly. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> How about this? Oh, I'm gonna, uh, there's 50 cents, and I'm just gonna push shuffle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shuffle. Wait, <laughs> hey, what's the wrong? What's the wrong? It's a long way to rock. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I'm waiting for my music. I know, it's just, I pay 50 cents. Yeah. <laughs> 75. Okay, no, I just, I just, um, I haven't. Sang in a long time. God, is this top radio or is this? <laughs> 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 oh, God, yeah. You know, I get nervous singing. I don't. You just told me you sang. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm telling you now. Uh, you Fair enough. Okay. Um, Do you want me to like pretend like I'll just? Yeah. Oh. Can you cover your ears and hum? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 hold on. Oh, hold on. No, no, no. no. Sorry to stop the car, uh, sir. Yeah, uh, we've got a little bit of a crisis here. We've got a uh, we've got a baby stuck in a tree. Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, and this baby isn't going to come down. It's out of reach of all of our fire engines, so it's not going to come down unless it's sung to. <laughs> Brian, I have five dollars in my wallet. Wait, wait, wait! Are you telling me one of you is a singer in this car? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> My best friend just told me that he sings. <laughs> no kidding, he's your best friend and you didn't know that? I know. Well, <laughs> it's a long story. We're driving to Rochester. Okay. You want to go? This is the Albany Rochester Expressway, so we're out here. The radio's broken. Oh, look, it must be a German car. <laughs>
Yeah, yeah. I thought that was metaphorical. No, what they do in there is like. I'm sorry, you forgot your new ID. <laughs> <laughs> Your man's angry. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm like a whole, literally a homie person. Oh no, you used to be 6'1". <laughs> I'm a petite. <laughs> I can't believe I've never fit into these little pants before. <laughs> this is great. I, I, I just can't believe. I'm standing next to a whole new person. This is a whole new chapter of our relationship. Well, actually, we're strangers. <laughs> Ingrid? Ingrid! Well, hi! I'm Theo! Nice to meet you! Yeah! <laughs> I'm not attracted to you anymore! I'm sorry! I'm sorry. <laughs> no, Ingrid, no friends with Theo. See? No life, no friends with yeah. you. I'm into gingers now, that's what they told me back there. That's right. Well, I mean, what if I go in and uh, I can maybe get like a reproduction Ron Weasley kind of thing going on How here? How much money? I have excellent health insurance. How much money? Well, I could probably take out a loan. I could probably come up with 15 grand. Not enough. <laughs> I've been saving for this for a long time. So wait, you're just gonna leave me? I come here to pick you up from the spa, you're a whole new person, you're hot now, and all of a sudden you're gonna leave me? I was always hot, number one. <laughs> okay, okay. First off, I don't know if that's true. Well, then I'm really leaving you. Fuck you. <laughs> I was my first. So, I said yeah. a lot of neat stuff. I don't know, I was yeah. angry. Uh, yeah, that was probably the wrong goodbye line. I think, uh, well, so, uh, you're, you need a place to stay, huh? Yeah, <laughs> just for a couple days, just till I can find a little bit of money, and then I can dye my hair red, and get <laughs> oh, her so back. Oh, you're going ahead with the spa, the transformation. Yeah, no, I'm going there. <laughs> I'm going there, and I'm going to get it done, because I want to be the man that she wants me to be. I, I made a lot of mistakes. Who? Monica, or? No, Ingrid. New Ingrid. you don't know Ingrid. No, no, I know, I don't know that now, but I understand that I love her. I've loved her before, I will love her again. I don't know, loving somebody you haven't met, uh, that sounds a little obsessive. Okay? <laughs> Maybe we play this one a little bit more coy, you know? Maybe you just see what opens up for you when you become a, what did she say, a ginger? Yeah, a ginger, it just means somebody with red it's hair. Derogatory, yeah. Wait, it's derogatory. Ginger is white, first of all, it's beige on the outside, white inside, yellow, if anything. Weird that they call them <laughs> red hats. <laughs> oh, I'll take that. Yeah, great. <laughs> so, uh, so how are things with you and Carol? Oh, great. We've never had more sex. <laughs> <laughs> I'll don't know, Big Bopper. <laughs> I'm not sure about taking this fight. I don't think people even remember who I am. Hey guys, it's me, Richie Ballard. Sorry, I'm late. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, I got that new, fresh radio hit, The Bamba. I'm gonna go put my stuff back here. Oh. Big Butler, I feel like you have a lot to say, but not a lot to say right now. Exactly, as I always do. Am I intimidating you as Buddy Holly? Totally. <laughs> I'm so intimidated. By you. You like got you. that plane, and we're gonna go on that plane. We are going. Oh, this is your captain speaking. Oh, I'll let you know that uh, one of our engines is at half capacity oh. and running with a chainsaw blade inside it. But we're gonna go ahead and take off as soon as this snow clears out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Patsy Klein, don't worry. I've refurbished this old plane. And it's good. It's good. Nothing to worry about. No one else has died on it. Oh. <laughs> All right. Thanks, baby. <laughs> All right. All right, John Denver, here's your glider. We're <laughs> <laughs> re newly refurbished. Right? <laughs> All you have to do is just, I'm going to get back here, I'm going to push it right off the mountain. <laughs> All right, John Daly, professional golfer. <laughs> <laughs> just relax on your private plane. All right.
I thought I had only two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 Hello. Dear, dear, what's so? I'm one of the proclaimers. <laughs> <laughs> my, my brother, cousin Matt, uh, was also in the proclaimers. Rest in peace. <laughs> that plane accident was horrible. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> <one of those, laughs> that was refurbished from Patsy Clyde's plane, which had the engine from Buddy Holly's plane, and also the pilot seat from uh, John Denver's plane crashed on him. I never thought I'd find someone who could sing as good as me, a Scottish man. <laughs> <laughs> so, I... <laughs> Thank you. Are you asking me to take over for you? Look, I know we're at this public place. It's an open mic. Yeah. But let's ask the crowd. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm Proclaimer known as Proclaimer Number One. <laughs> as you all know, Proclaimer Number Two died. But this guy, name unknown, <laughs> Brian. Brian. You know, do you seem like maybe we could make another Proclaimers album? Crowd, do you want to hear where the 500 miles went? <laughs> this, is, this is how stars are made. <laughs> this is it. I'm going to put on my guitar. Let's just see where this goes. Let's get back this motherfucker. Go. <laughs> just to be the man who walked up. Love you. Au revoir. Jeremy, hit the